Hello guys and welcome back to another Skype Mechanic video. Uh, my name is Tyler aka Sinistre um, and today uh, we're going to be farming to try and get to the um, closer or at least closer to um, the spuddling gun and the shotgun so that would be an exciting thing. Um, I did a little bit of farming um, some other time. What is this lag? I did some farming already. I think I already have 10 of each. Or, I'm sorry, not 10 of each, but, um, oh my god. Uh, just loading everything in. I just started my world. Oh, we got a wheelie. But, um, if you guys can see, I am driving a new vehicle. Now, this vehicle is completely fuelless. Um, I just scrapped my other vehicle and I made, I wanted something that was a little bit heavier and, um, you know, something that's, you know, not gonna flip out on me, but also looked cool, but this thing kind of flips out on me, so I gotta make some adjustments to it, but, you know, aesthetically, it kind of looks a little bit pleasing. You know, let me down, let me know down in the comment, the com <laughs> comment section, um, what you guys think, um, and yeah. Uh, so we're gonna continue with the, uh, far oh, why is it leaking? Okay, can't accept any more. You're gonna just throw that stuff in, up in there. And we're gonna grab our seeds. All right, so I just got everything planted. Now I just have to have the water system go, which hopefully waters everything. Uh, I still have to make some adjustments on it, like the pitch, maybe a little bit more, like 15% will be okay so let's see if that makes a difference oh it does it works oh and we're out of water but i'm gonna have to go down here and grab some water buckets because of the initial these down here going and we got these and then after we water them we will fertilize them and get on the way Wait, which one did it, which one did I do? Crap. I don't know which one I did, so I'm just gonna redo them. All right, everything is now fertilized. Ah, uh, you can see the little green aroma. If you really uh, pay attention to it. But uh, yeah, so we got, I think we have enough spuds. I just want to make sure because this raid's going to be hefty and this stuff isn't going to plant in time, which actually, how much do I get down here? Okay. So I have about 10 pineapples or 15 pineapples and 15 broccoli. I want to relatively, you know, have enough because it's, I think it's like five, um, per or no four for the shotgun. Or for you know, or, uh, four loads of broccoli for the shotgun and five loads of the pineapple for the spuddling gun. But I want both of them just for, you know, easy taking for bosses and such. But um, I'm hoping that this doesn't go to night three because if this goes to night three, when I was offline, I got it to night three. And um, a boss came and... I barely got through. I had a lot more of the scrap defenses beforehand and it was just all taken out. But um yeah, now we farming, you know, we don't do that much competitive stuff. Uh if you guys actually know me, I hate competitive games. So like stuff like this where you actually have to use your brain in order to uh do a bunch of stuff uh this is pretty cool to me. Um so yeah, so uh we're just going to, you know, camp out here and um yeah, we're going to get, you know, some, oh man, why does this burger look so good? Is... Does that have fries on there? It does have fries on there. Oh man. Ooh, I'm hungry. <laughs> Alright, so uh, we'll come back once it, the raid starts. Alright, so um, we got about like 2 minutes and 40 seconds to spare real quick, but I think I know what I'm going to do. Um, I think I'm going to go back and, you know, redo this water system because I don't exactly, like, know what 
it's gonna do and it's just gonna be weird um or it's weird right now is what i'm trying to say uh but you know it's i don't know something i want to make more efficient especially because i don't i don't see myself making a bigger plot than this you know maybe down the line but like you know as of right now like farming to me is i'm only going to be farming this until i have the uh weapons unless you know something new comes out like maybe like a rocket launcher or something uh excellent if you're listening to this which i highly doubt you are rocket launchers people want them but uh yeah so after the broccoli and pineapple things grow i'm gonna be getting the smuggling gun and then i'm going to probably not farm this these high tier ones anymore i'm probably gonna be focusing on something else um what i want to do is you know establish my base more uh make it so like there's a bunch of different systems and like you know craft speed improves and all that other stuff uh the only thing is is that it takes a lot of grinding so um yeah so you know i, I definitely have the material if i wanted to make this a series which I'm, I'm planning on it you know so plan on seeing more of this um and also too uh you know with the minute left let's see if i can do this in a minute um so down in the description below there's a link to discord i made a new discord channel for my um youtube channel uh where everyone can connect and stuff talk to me personally um uh, i'm gonna try my best to respond but uh you know everyone has a crazy schedule throughout the day mine's mine's all over the place but uh you know um and then you can leave down suggestions of what you want to see me play because i'll i'll play anything you guys want me to play uh but right now i'm playing scrap mechanic because i thoroughly enjoy this game um so yeah so link down in the description along with my social medias uh so make sure you just follow me on everything um and if you haven't yet please subscribe i'm trying to beat mr legend because he surpassed me but uh yeah so with that in mind um i have spuds and one and let's do this let's oh god laggy all right what we got coming what we got coming oh i got tape bots oh oh no you all right and there's all right uh is there anything else oh hello guys that's one thing i like about this spot is because then you know you don't get the full attack i have eight spuds left um well before i kill those guys let's uh let's Let's do this. Um. Whoa. I got get bounced. He's probably gonna run over here now. Uh, this stuff hasn't sprouted yet. Yeah, he is. Come on. Boom. All right, now let's go reap the rewards. All right, so we got uh, about five uh, Haybot Spines. I think that's what they're called. Um, and, uh, but yeah, as I was talking about before, make sure you check out my link in the description. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe. And also too, as a, you know, since you're gonna be doing all that stuff anyway, you might as well leave a like on the video um, or not. But you know, if you enjoy the content, it helps me know that I'm doing a good job so please um anyway on that note um let's just uh you know continue refining this stuff and then we'll head actually I don't even want to leave just yet because I want to see if these things will sprout before uh 4 30 in the morning we'll get the authorized farming again if that happens uh we will be in a world of trouble um so I'm really hoping that these things finish because, I mean, as much as we do need the materials, I don't know if I'll have the resources in order to do a second night wave. If we have to, 
we'll be able to do it. I'm not saying we won't be able to, but um, it'll kind of put a little damper in the um, the rest of the episode. But uh, yeah, so there's that. Another thing too, real quick, you know, what do you guys think of the green screen setup? Um, it's probably really hazily. I still have a lot of things I needed to work out the kinks with. Um, there's like, a, you know, the lighting issues and stuff, but um, yeah, I think I'm really going to enjoy this. I'm really enjoying, oh, and there's the end of the ice farm detected, but I'm really enjoying having a green screen and actually being able to show this. I mean, I could before, but it was just not a good backdrop, but just not having anything there. So it looks like we're going to have another um, or invasion. Ooh, all that planted at the same time. That's so satisfying. Or sprouted at the same time. But uh, yeah, what we're going to do though is that we're not going to plant again. Um, and we are going to get through the rest of this. And then do whatever raid comes tonight and then uh continue on from there um and again you know uh just take my time with this because this is my first real series i want to continue with and hopefully grow with you know it'll be a great time yeah actually we have 17 minutes so we might as well take a dilly dally thing back to the uh base one thing i do like about this thing i mean as much as i wanted more of a calm vehicle it's it does wheelies it does really well on the wheelies like it doesn't flip itself over like look at just subtle um and i also got a windshield on there um some t-tops you know what i should do is <laughs> that would be really cool is do um add t-tops that close i think that would be really neat but uh yeah so we're gonna head back to the base uh, i definitely do, i don't want to go out mining while that timer is up because it just it just terrifies me i'm so scared to go over to my farming plot and everything be gone and that's why you saw my chest under the water because i don't think they're going to be swimming down to take out my chests so yeah there's the hat <laughs> all right so now we're back so what do we got in here we got this stuff we'll drop this stuff off um oh, and this make more fuel it's one thing that's nice about that farming plot it's right by the open water where i can while i'm waiting i can just go grab fuel so i can stay productive oh yeah this is another thing too so i'm currently playing in the test uh form of scrap mechanic uh where you're able to make fertilizer and you know and the chemical container and stuff and i am loving it the only reason i wanted to switch over was because of the fertilizer and the gas pickup because i i went out for like five minutes uh the other night with mr legend and we came back with a consecutive 200 oil containers or not oil containers but uh just oil and uh i just thought that was really neat um, but yeah, so last, from last video, I did a little bit of reorganizing. Uh, this is all organized and you're actually able to see each in, in individual spot that doesn't do anything. And I got all the wheels on the back, uh, with my, like, chest, my chest full of tools. Ooh, actually, where's this? I think there was a battery in here. Yeah, we're just going to deposit that battery. I don't have anything that's battery related, but just in case if we ever do, it's ready to go. Um, but yeah, uh, oh, that closes the door. <laughs> I have so many switches in here. I got one that closes off the lights, um, closes the door, opens that door, closes that door. Um, yeah. I made this last night too that has some food in it. I just thought it was neat. It's only, it's not that much storage, but like, it's still pretty cool. You know, I, like, it has almost a kitchen aesthetic, aesthetic to it. Um, so yeah, let's just, uh, let's go out. Uh, let's make sure that the miner 
has all the st stuff that it needs. Um, start off with fuel. All right, that's all full. We have ample amount of fuel, guys, but this thing just guzzles it. Um, and then... Okay, so yeah, this brings that out. This is for tree logging. Uh, it's my simple tree logger. I plan on making a better one sometime later, but, um, you know, best to have both, best of both worlds right here. It turns it on. This extends that out. This is for my miner. And then we have lights. But, uh, yeah, so... You know, this is my base, and one more extensive look at it. I still absolutely love this. Where it just folds up and in. I mean, it's really off and floppy, but like, it's an eventual, it's it's like a hypothetical build. I'm probably gonna revamp it all sometime, and or I kinda wanna move my base. Um, and then this over here is my logger, or my mill, sorry. So what happens is that I put the tree on there, I push it in with that button, and then I turn on the, like that, and it drills it, goes into these resource collectors, and it gets refined right away, and all I have to do is just go in, and grab the wood, and then leave. So it's very efficient, um, and I don't really like the idea of having a mobile logger, because it's just the weight issue. But, you know, world of possibilities, I might later on, we don't know yet. But uh, yeah, let's, let's go ahead back to the uh, farming plot. Because I, like my anxiety is starting to build up or not being there. It's just overwhelming. Like part of me wishes that like once you clear your field of all the crops, it just disappears. Because then we don't have to wait this long. And especially because who knows, man, you know, like, how do the Haybots know that we farmed there at 430 in the morning? World is just full of mysteries, you know, but, um, I don't expect to get the sputtling and or shotgun today, uh, because I still have to go and get farmers, but, um, but yeah, so, um, what I might do is after we defend this tonight, I'm going to end the video and then pick up next time with trying to go collect farmers. And then in between that time, I'll just farm the rest of the pineapples and such and, you know, go on from there. Uh, and also, too, if you don't know how we got the pineapples, uh, there is on my channel a video, very first Scrap Mechanic Survival video. Um, where me and Mr. Legend raided a warehouse, so make sure to go check that out. Um, I'm not putting it in the description, don't. You, you can't expect me to do that. You know, it's just it's just two clicks away, guys. Two clicks. I, I gotta get a spotlight right here, because it, it's, it kind of sucks not being able to, or just use your vehicle for spotlight. Um, and the only reason I put my vehicle up here is because, you know, it's the safest spot for this whole thing, and I can also see. Uh, so thank God that we don't have to use power for lights or anything like that. Just, you know, no one knows how it just turns on with no power, but, you know, good, good thing it does, you know. And that's the fuelless part, is all those components right there. Um... But yeah, so, you know, we'll, we'll come back when it's time to do the raid. <laughs> Alright guys, um, you know, if you guys hear anything in my background, it's just, you know, my family's dogs going crazy and all that other stuff. But uh, anyway, uh, so, you know, and another thing too, this game isn't all about farming. There's a lot of engineering stuff, and you know, some of the questions I get for people who do watch my videos um, are like, you know, is it a farming game only or anything like that? And yes, there is farming, but there's a lot of engineering. And um, people who know the game will tell you also that it like you need to be able to construct everything because everything right here is like 
blocks like that. So you got to be able to like, you know, plan, pick and choose design all your uh, creations and such. Um, and yeah, so like, you know, like this, I designed myself the my base. I designed myself. I grinded the materials and such. Even this, I grinded the materials and such. Um, you know, so, uh, you know, there's definitely a lot of time that goes into this game. Especially with just brain power. Like, sometimes I get off this game and I'm just mentally exhausted. Because I just put a lot of, like, just thinking into, like, what to do. I mean, I know, like, this and stuff. It's, like, all crud and stuff. But this is just stuff that we picked up along the way. Once it gets destroyed, I'll fortify it to be look a lot better. Um, and, uh, sorry about that, guys. My phone was going off. Uh, it might be Mr. Legend. Um, told him I was recording and, uh, yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, so, like, even, even with, like, everything else, like, you gotta be able to, you know, use a controller to, you know, find the perfect length, find the perfect angle, uh, logic gates that, like, you know, go to, like, nano, XOR, and, and find that perfect timing situation in order to do a bunch of other stuff. So, uh, with that being said, you know, we got 30 seconds left. Uh, until the tier 2 raid that is a living nightmare um i'm really hoping a boss doesn't show up uh but uh yeah so let's uh let's <laughs> let's get on with it oh man four three two one let's do this it. Oh god, he got right in. What the hell? Is all this stuff just too Oh god. Do I Is that it? Alright, we got the guys over there. Oh my god, wait, where's, where are we getting shot from? Where are they shooting from? They're not in the water, are they? I think they're in the water, what the hell? Oh god. Yeah, they are. I'll oh, just cycle through. Oh my god, it killed me. Are you kidding me? Alright, come on. Oh my god. This is stupid. I can't even get to him. I'm gonna have to wait this out. I didn't realize that they went in the water. Oh wait, is this guy still alive? Oh, hi buddy. That was probably my most ridiculous raid. I mean, it's still technically going on, it's just, I can't do anything right now. Oh no. Oh no. Boo boo no. Are you kidding me? This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I mean, luckily I didn't have that much stuff on me, but like, still. That was ridiculous. Oh, where is he? Oh my god, it needs to get to 4 o'clock in the morning so they leave me alone. These guys are so overpowered. The teapot is ridiculous. Oh, that's something interesting. Yes, leave. Or did it just disappear? Please tell me it just disappeared and were drowned because... Wait, what? My wheel? You deserve that. My... It disconnected my wheel. Oh my god. Is this even gonna work? I'm gonna have to... Oh. Oh man. Alright, well, <laughs> this has been it for today's video. I'm completely stressed out now. 
um well i'm gonna go fix all that stuff um and uh if you guys enjoyed this video and or enjoyed hearing me rage uh, make sure you leave a like, uh, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, leave a comment about your favorite part because, um, yeah. So uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.